today we are going to begin with the concept of addition and its properties. Addition. Addition is the process whereby we put to together objects from different sets or groups. For example, look at this table with the two pile of books. Suppose the first pile has 24 books and the second pile has 18 books. And I ask you, what is the total number of books on the table? What will you do? You will add 24 plus 18 and when you add 24 plus 18, you will get 42. So, I can say that there are 42 books on the table altogether. Let us quickly revise the terms used for the numbers in addition. That is the terms of addition. Considering the same example, you added 24 books plus 18 books to get a total of 42 books. So here the numbers 24 and 18 which you added are called add-ins and 42 the answer that you got is called sum. So the numbers that are added are called add-ins. So add-in plus add-in is equal to the answer which is called sum. Now let us do the properties of addition. The first property is we can add two or more than two add-ins. You know you can add two add-ins. We just did an example. But suppose I give you 12 plus 14 plus 22. Three add-ins. How will you find the sum? You will begin by calculating the sum of the first two add-ins. So you will do 12 plus 14 which is equal to 26. And then you will add the sum plus the third add-in 22. 26 plus 22 is equal to 48. So you got the sum. 12 plus 14 plus 22 is equal to 48. Second property is even if we interchange the add-ins, the sum remains unchanged. For example, if you do 16 plus 23, you will get 39. But if you decide to interchange the add-ins and write 23 first plus 16 later, the sum will still be 39. So you can also say that 16 plus 39 is equal to 39 plus 16. The next property of addition is the sum of 0 and any number is the number itself. For example, 30, 318 plus 0 is equal to 318 or if you interchange the add-ins and write 0 plus 318, the sum is 318. One more property of addition is the sum obtained on adding 1 to any number will always be the successor of that number. For example, if you add 284 plus 1, you will get the successor of 284 which is 285. If you interchange and write 1 plus 284, then also the sum will be the successor of 284 which is 285.